And Hong Kong is a tradition for us, eh? It is so important to the fans in Fiji, especially seven rugby people in the world. The atmosphere is electrifying. Bro, Hong Kong Sevens, bro, Hong Kong Sevens. <laughs> The crowd is amazing here. You know, you dream about playing in front of crowds like this. The Fijian team has always felt at home playing here. Hong Kong is the glue that holds all the tournaments together. You know what I mean? It's a highlight of the whole Seven Circuit. Hong Kong is the place, eh? It's got a lot of history behind it, eh? We respect and we honor the tradition and the history that uh, Fiji have with the Hong Kong Seven. Four years running. Kings of Hong Kong! The people who are now watching it, the young ones, they've had their parents, their grandparents who watched it. And the fact that it has got that uh, pulling power, it pulls everybody together, you know. The women joining, the children joining, everybody joins. That's a magic about Hong Kong, eh? It unites the, the whole nation. Before the game, you know, heart is pumping, boom, 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 kick off. First try scored by Fiji. Woo! Stab! Everyone cheering, cheering, cheering. Second try, you know? Once you are comfortable in there, then, you know, then the heart rate slows down, normal, eh? But when it's a tight game, woo! Players like Lau Lau, Honda, and then the maestro, Wesley Srevi, they've showed the world, you know, with the little that they have, but the great talent that God has given them, they're able to display it and bring the smiles and the joys to the fans. Not only Fijian fans, but fans all over the globe. Uh, when I went out there, uh, starting in 1989 until 2009, all those uh, nearly more than 18 years, playing at the Sevens, it's a really important part of my life. And uh, without the Hong Kong Sevens, there's no voice less ravey, and there's a lot of players in world rugby have made their name at the Hong Kong Sevens. Never mind if you play uh, Sevens in other tournaments, if you haven't played in Hong Kong, then you haven't represented Fiji. All Fijian players know when it comes to Hong Kong, they have to perform. Whether they are rookies or whether they are experienced players, you know, everybody has to rise to the occasion. And that's the expectation, riding on their backs when they go to, to Hong Kong. Never mind if they lose anywhere else, we win Hong Kong and that like, you know, it makes everybody happy, you know, they, they forget all the losses. If Fiji doesn't win, uh, like, any tournaments, but win Hong Kong, that's it for us, eh? Like, we've won the series, eh? We cannot all fit in that uh, sevens team, eh? If you can make the team, then cheer for the team, eh? Cheer for the team. Cheer your hearts, your lungs out, everything. I asked Semi Konotani, do you guys ever hear our singing at the stadium when you're in the changing room? And Semi Kontani said, when we hear the Fijian song, Vono Domoni, it gives us so much more strength. And we sometimes go into tears to go out there and play our utmost best for our country. It makes people smile for the whole week, or maybe for the next three months, because of Hong Kong, you know, when you win Hong Kong. So we got married last Friday yep. and decided, like, hello, honeymoon, perfect place where Hong Kong Seven. <laughs> The tears of joy when Fiji wins and you feel so much a part of the team and proud to be a Fijian. And I guess for every Fijian going to Hong Kong is a dream of a lifetime.